to his long home, and the mourners go about the streets. Yep, and we're the mourners, man, that go about the streets, man. We're mourning, you know, it says much, much knowledge and wisdom increases sorrow, man. You know, we pissed off, man. You know, that's why I, I guess ignorance is bliss, man. You niggas just don't want to know. But you do know, though. You know your spirit, your spirit is, is crying out, man. You niggas is too, it is, your, your pineal gland is too calcified, and you want it like that, man. You know, it says that in Second uh, in Second Peter's, man, that you willingly are ignorant, man. You purposely don't want to know, man. You don't want to be an Israelite. You want to be an Egyptian because you, that means you can stay in America. If we tell you you're an Israelite, then you got to, <laughs> uh, like Micah 2 and 10 says, you have to depart. You niggas don't want to depart. Okay? They want to build their empire in America. Yeah, you want to build an Emotep statue in the middle of this motherfucker, man. And, and, and you want you want your own business and be respected as a cracker, man. Ain't no fucking king. A king, he just, he just do what he is, who he is, man. And you better respect that. You know what I'm saying? He, and when he, I say he is who he is, he do big things. You know? If a king, if he's a king, if you're a king, and your people, you got people, your people have a culture, man. You walk around with your beds and your dashikis and shit, nobody gonna look at you and laugh. That's, that's your fucking kingdom, man. Just like they don't look at Esau and laugh when he have on his fucking suit and tie. Which is a fucking a, a dick around his neck. But nobody laughs at that because they in rulership and that's how they rocking, man. You know what I'm saying? We laugh at it because we in a different culture, man. But we're not in rulership, so these niggas laugh at us because we don't have that 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 corno power, man. You know? It says, verse 6, or ever the silver cord be loose. Or the golden bowl be broken, or the pitcher be broken at the fountain, or the wheel bro uh, broken at the cistern. Then shall the dust return, turn to the earth as it was. Yeah, this America's going to turn to dust. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust, man. You know, this motherfucker is going to be dust, man. There ain't going to be no little arm of Lady Liberty, Lady Liberty sticking out of the ground like on uh, Planet of the Apes. This motherfucker's gonna be laid flat, okay? It's gonna be scorpions and rattlesnakes and shit, man. It's gonna be like, um, even gonna be even worse than in Mad Max Fury, Fury, you know? When, when it was just straight desert, man. Desert everywhere, man. It's just gonna be, you know, smoke and, and dust, you know? Go ahead. <coughs> Ain't no be no gas and shit, you know? <laughs> oh boy, fucking all the people with that water and shit. That shit was hilarious to me, you know? Man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to this shit off on these niggas. <laughs> Fuck all of them people, why y'all do that? Go ahead. It says, <clears throat> And the spirit shall return unto the Most High who gave it. Vanity of vanities, saith save the preacher. All is vanity. All is vanity. You know, at the end of the day, all this shit that people are doing is, is pointless because America's going to be destroyed, man. And so you ignoring and, and and acting like you don't see because you got a goal. It ain't a real goal. You're just trying to get money. You're just trying to make ends meet. But the Most High told you that you're going to be straight, man. It just it's the it's, it's the uh the illusion that you're not going to be straight. You know? But when you don't lean on the most high, of course you're not going to be straight. Of course you're going to have to fucking run and do this. Man, money going to come and money going to go. I don't know how, but every time I end up with some fucking money, you know, my bills get paid. You know, I know how I work, you know what I'm saying, of course. But when you look and you're like, damn, I don't know how I'm going to do this. I don't know how I'm going to But you end up doing it. You're still here. You know, way you made it this far and it's like you got to keep chasing money. Like, no one's just shit. You know, that's why I, I looked at it like, man, I'm, you know, you, you try to work doubles and do all this shit and, and just to pay your bills and then, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, I'm always going to get this fucking money, man. You know what I'm saying? This shit going to come. I'm going to have to do what I got to do, you know? Of course, righteously, you know? So, like, why why go crazy behind something that you're already going to keep getting and you're going to keep losing? 
I don't care if you lose a hundred dollars or, or you gamble it away or do whatever, you're gonna get a hundred dollars again sometime. You know, you're gonna get that shit right back. Why fucking worry about it, man? Why worry about the you know clothes on your back and things like that? Just you gotta serve the Lord. And of course you go and you work and you do things like that, you know, and the most high gonna take care of the rest, man. That's a worry that's unnecessary, man. Niggas be worried about doing all that shit. Because that ultimately it ain't gonna be nothing, man. This motherfucker gonna be ashes to ashes and dust to dust. And every motherfucker that didn't serve the most high or is a heathen within these borders are gonna be uh, uh, going to going taste of the first death, man. Really the second death. You know? Uh, um, alluding to uh, revelations, man. Talking about the missiles, you know, lighting your ass up. You know? And that's going to be a beautiful thing. That should be it to that. That should be it to that. Um, so, you know, and it's, it's very, very cold out here today. So, uh, we're going to cut it short, you know, because it's not too tolerable. Uh, for the body, you know. Uh, so, with that being said, and we, uh, uh, let's pan around. Uh, camera man, you know. Pan around, you're going to show our river, you know, because. <laughs> <laughs> our river. Show our river, you know. This is our shit right here. The most high gave us this spot, you know. We got a couple other spots. You know, Satan took over one of them, you know. But that that's a river, you know. Right, so this be a lake. You can see footprints and shit. You know, we can throw a brick in that shit. You know, and that's what you call brick coal, man. <laughs> you know, we, we are out here though, you know, but it, it, it is too cold to be out here that long, man. We're gonna lose some limbs or some shit, man. You know, uh, but with that being said, we're gonna go hard, man. We ain't got no choice, man. It's, it's a, uh, a beautiful thing to serve the Lord and every opportunity to do so, you know, uh, Lord willing, us and all the other brothers do it, man. You know, so when we get on that chariot, we could, you know, we can say that we earned our spot, man. Okay? And all the other brothers earned this spot. You know, ain't nobody better than nobody else. The brothers will be telling these stories and be like, yeah, man. You know, we yeah, we went through hell and high water, man. You know? That's the beauty of it, man. It says, uh, get that scripture for me, bless You know, to go afflictions for my sake. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah. Uh, you can feed us for John. Suffer persecution and things like that. For righteousness sake? Yeah, yeah. This is on 1 Peter 3 and 14. But, but, uh, but, and if ye suffer for the righteousness sake, happy are ye. Yeah, happy are ye. Go ahead. Why? Because you suffering, you suffering for the most high. And the most high's repayment is salvation, man. You know how beautiful it is to, to be the first, to, to get the first fruits of the kingdom, man? You know? That new car smell? You know, we're gonna be we're gonna be in the kingdom getting that new car smell, so to speak, man. You know, we're gonna break the kingdom in. You know, you, when somebody build that crispy new house and you the first nigga to, you know, not nigga, but you the first person to set foot in that joker, that's a you know, like damn, you know, break it in. We we gonna be Lord willing, Lord willing, you know. Yeah, how we're willing, we uh get the breaking Breaking the kingdom, man. You know? Going to that, walking to the mansion, man. That's a beautiful thing, man. You know? To get beamed down and, and you walk, uh, uh, you just going into the mansions, man. You know? I don't even know. It's, gonna, it's, it's, it's a, a, a crazy feeling. Then you get to see how shy. You can see David. You know? The 12 disciples. Okay? All the brothers together. You know? You know, it, it's gonna be a beautiful thing, man, and, and that's what we doing this for, man. Okay, so y'all, y'all said we're wasting our time. Our faith is in that. That's why our faith is. Okay, your faith is in your next paycheck. You know, I don't got no faith in no paycheck, but I'm getting, a, I'm getting one. Shit, why put your faith in something you gonna get already? Let's say hope that is seen is not hope. Hope that is seen is not hope. You know, 
I'm, we hoping on something you, you can't even see, you know? It sounds like we telling a fairy tale, man, you know? But when it, when it manifests, oh, man, you know, I might pass out like niggas be on a roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> be falling and shit, wake up, be landing, you know? <laughs> Beam down our chain, fall up, pass out, and just enjoy it, man. It's going to be a beautiful thing, man, you know? And that's a, that's a blessing from the Most High to choose Israel, man. You know, it's a blessing, man. So with that being said, call hello, Yahweh, Hashim, Yahshai, double honest to the apostles, and blessings to the elect in uh, Delta, Delta America, man.